Hello everybody, welcome back to another Minecraft snapshot and today I will be reviewing snapshot 13w16a. As you can see the Minecraft um, <laughs> launcher is right here, it's brand new. Um, some of you may recognize the design from Feed the Beast or Take It or something like that, but um, this is a new design I'm implementing and it's actually pretty cool. I'll put links always in the description, the links to all the launchers for Windows, Mac and Linux users and also the links to the Wikipedia page and the Mojang website. So um, basically it shows you what version of snapshot you're using up here. Um, I don't know if they're actually going to put a list of snapshots there for the future snapshots but that's there anyway. Obviously this is still in development so there are going to be lots of bugs. If you do have any bugs uh, report it to Mojang and they'll try and fix it. Um, down here you can see just put your login details and username and password and you can also register for Minecraft and the whole Mojang um, account right there. So when you're ready to play, you just press play and then the launcher will come up. Basically this uploads everything, all the GIF files, the image files, the blocks, the items, the mobs, the terrain and everything like that. It just downloads all those. You can see on the files as well where your application is, where the um, actual Minecraft is and it launches here. So if you're into coding Java and mods and stuff, you'll know what all the um, <laughs> this stuff um, says. So as you can see it's loading up the textures for blocks right here and the items. Um, the other thing about this launcher is it does take a while for everything to load up. We're not, it's not instant like the um, original Minecraft. This is a completely separate um, Minecraft um, file so it's, um, I mean application, so it's a completely different one. Um, it's actually called Minecraft Dev, you can see right there. So you open this, uh -huh. like this. And then I'm just going to my single player world and I have a new uh, <laughs> file here called Minecraft Dev which is my brand new snapshot world just for the development of the launch for thing. So I've left my 1.5 world behind and we're starting a new one. So yes, there are horses in Minecraft and it's raining. I have to um, do this. Okay, let's just stop the rain for a minute. I can't hear what I'm saying. <laughs> Alright, there you go. So, first of all, there are lots of features, as I said. Most of these you can't get in survival. You actually need to go into your creative inventory to get them. Um, and there are also some features that I actually can't get in the inventory, which is kind of weird. But, let's start. So, first of all, we have carpets. Now, there are loads of variety of these. Every single piece... Um, Every single color ball has their own uh, carpet. So right here, you make it with two pieces of wool like this, and you get a carpet. And it just you now sounds like wool. Same thing. Uh, if you have wood underneath it, it sounds like wood, basically. But um, yeah, it's pretty cool. You know, you can use it in your Minecraft house, make it look all fancy instead of putting wool down everywhere. <laughs> you know, and I think they actually count as a full block. I'm not actually sure. Let me try and put something on top of it. So yeah, it counts as a full block. You can see right there. Let's change my game mode a minute. Alright, so there you can see it's a full block. And also another feature of this snapshot, um, respiration actually helps with seeing underwater now. And this is a horsey! So cute! And this horse actually has armor on, gold armor. There are three types of armor. There is iron armor, gold armor, and diamond armor. I love the iron armor, it's kind of like I kind of think it's like Egyptian, kind of Roman kind of armor. Iron armor is just the basic kind of chainmail armor. Looks pretty cool again. Diamond armor looks cool as well, but I think that looks a bit like a toy kind of horse, so I like the gold armor much better. There we go. That's how you do it right there. So, if you want to go up here, we can actually ride a horse. So basically, um, they don't have noises or anything, so don't worry about that. Um, they're still in development. These are from the creators of Mo Creatures, um, so he's actually been working with Mojang to help them with that. And I actually had some horses in the stables, but they despawned. Um, they are two blocks long and two blocks high, so they can actually jump over a, a two block space. They can actually jump um, over a bay hill if it's right there. So if you want to um, get onto your horse, you simply walk up to it with an empty hand and right click. There we go. Right click, and he just threw me off, I used a saw. If you do it again, he should. Okay, be on here for a little while. 
you have to stay on him for a couple of seconds and then he'll get the hearts and then you'll be able to see let me try this in f5 mode so right click and then stay on him for a while and do his thing sometimes it takes a while for him to actually him or her to actually get used to you let's try again come on come on nope you don't like me <laughs> oh boy oh there you go see the hearts Okay, now he loves you. Ah, oh, just about. Come on, dude. Is that it? Yes, he's mine. He is? I think he is. Yes, he is. Alright, so let's get out of here. So the trackpad is... Oh, the mouse. I need to get into FI mode again. Let's open this gate. So he moves, he or she moves where you want them to move. And you can actually jump two blocks high as well, I think. So, um, get off of you and go over to my horse right here. Hello, horse. I haven't actually named him yet. I don't know what to call him. But anyway, Don Yu. So he has, actually has a saddle on as well as the armor. So let's ride him. And then you can just, you know, press forward or whatever you want. And you can jump over the fences as you just saw. Looks pretty cool as well, you know. I'm a rhinestone cowgirl. <laughs> So you just walk, press forwards, and there's also uh, food that you can give them, like wheat and sugar, to make them go faster as well. And jump, Whee! yeah, cowgirl, do your thing. So that's basically it. There's the horses. Also, um, hay bales right here. Um, they don't actually eat them yet. I don't know if you can actually breed them. And there are obviously lots of breeds of horses that you can get. So into inventory and get a horse egg and then you can see in here <clears throat> you can see loads of variety of horses i haven't actually counted how many varieties there are but all i know is there's a lot of them and also donkeys and mules <laughs> donkeys are not horses oh i don't think donkeys are horses i actually know if they are classes horses and there are also baby horses as well um i believe the babies actually stay as babies in creative mode but i guess they do grow um in survival mode so that is basically it for this snapshot. Thank you very much for watching. Again, I will definitely update you. Um, actually, let me try something very quickly. I'm going to try and do the water thing again. This time it's dark. Let me try it. So let's just make a hole here. Alright, put it down to bedrock. Uh huh. Let's fill this in the water. There you go. Let's do this. Fill this in the water as well. Okay. Let's see how dark it is. That's pretty dark. Alright, let's try the helmet, see if it makes a difference. Mm hmm Okay. Oh yeah, it's much clearer actually. Let's take the helmet off. Yeah, it's much clearer. Look at that. You probably can't see it on the video, but it does actually change the lighting actually changes much clearer. So that is the official end of the uh, snapshot video. Thank you very much for watching and also there aren't actually recipes for the saddles or the hay bales yet but there are supposedly le leashes that you can get to actually tie the horse to a fence post but as you can see it's not in my inventory. I've looked all over the Wikipedia. Um, there is actually a picture of the leash in the Wikipedia. Um, I don't know if there's a recipe for it. I did look it up, but I couldn't find anything, so they might have updated it today, I don't really know. But thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next snapshot. Peace out. You're so cute. I might call you Monty. Or Goldie. Goldie? I don't know, I've never had a pet before. See you later, guys. Peace out.